In this example, uh, we're given uh, the graphs of a couple of functions, and uh, we want to determine if these functions are one-to-one. -one. So recall that a function is one-to-one -one if different inputs, uh, different x values, in other words, always match different outputs, uh, different y values. So if different inputs, x values always match different uh, output values, uh, y values, then a function is said to be one-to-one. -one. Now you can determine uh, if a function represented by a graph is one-to-one -one by using what's known as the horizontal line test. So if any horizontal line uh, is going to uh, intersect uh, the graph of the function in exactly one point, or at most one point, then um, the function is one-to-one. -one. So uh, for instance, if we look at uh, uh, the function here graphed uh, in example A, uh, if you imagine uh, any horizontal line uh, drawn here on this same set of axes, notice that's only going to intersect uh, this function in at most one point. And so uh, the function A is one-to-one. Uh, -one. Now the function graphed here in example A is one-to-one. -one. On the other hand, uh, notice that there are lots of horizontal lines we can draw that will intersect uh, the function graphed in B uh, in um, multiple points, uh, in fact, in two points. Uh, for instance, if we graph the horizontal line um, y equals 4, so that's a horizontal line that uh, has y intercept at 4, so let me draw that line in. Notice that that's going to uh, intersect uh, this graph at a couple of points, uh, this point on the left and also this point on the right. So what that indicates is that there are two different inputs for this function that have uh, the same uh, matching output, uh, namely uh, minus 4. Uh, notice its uh, matching output will be uh, 4. And also positive 4. Um, its matching output will also be uh, positive 4. So there are uh, different inputs, uh, different x values that have the same uh, output, the same uh, matching y value. And you cannot have that in a one-to-one -one function uh, because in a one-to-one -one function, different inputs all must have different uh, output values. So um, the vertical line, I mean, sorry, the horizontal line tell, uh, test tells us that uh, uh, this function graphed in um, example B, although it is a function, uh, is not one-to-one. -one. It's not a one-to-one -one function. Uh, but on the other hand, uh, the horizontal line test indicates that um, uh, this function graphed uh, in example A uh, is an example uh, of a one-to-one -one function.